time to unsheath the katana. No, Britt countered, rolls through. Fighting Sheeta out. Here comes, get it on. Sheeta, her arms are captured. Oh, she's in trouble. She's in trouble. And there it is, the lockjaw. Hikaru Sheeta, no choice but to tap out. What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here. And welcome to After News. Like, so it was Dr. Britt Baker's first time in the ring since last year, man. Uh, you know, we knew she'll be back in the ring soon, at least some point before the match at All In with Mercedes Monet. And it kind of ran me when Mercedes Monet had her first match at Double or Nothing. You know, we had seen them. You know, maybe you haven't seen them in the ring in a long time. You kind of forgot, like, damn, how they fight. And. You know, I thought I always think Britt Baker, while she's not one of the best women's in-ring workers out there, I definitely think she's kind of underrated as far as like people always saying, "Oh, she can't, she can't fight or whatever." Like, I don't think she's that bad. I, I really don't think she's as bad as what people say. Uh, that narrative has got to go uh, when it comes to Britt Baker, man. It's not, it's not a good. Like, I've seen some bad wrestlers before in the women's division throughout the history man and none of them look as good as Britt Baker I'll tell you that right now man <laughs> you know but like I said she's not one of the best but I, I do believe that she's better than what people say but anyways so we saw Hikaru Shida who hasn't really been on Dynamite she's been on um, Collision I believe in uh, Rampage uh, for the last month or so but uh, this is the first time we've seen Hikaru Shida on Dynamite in a while and uh, she's a three-time AW Women's Champion. I, I'll be wondering sometimes, like, when is she gonna, when are they gonna pull the trigger on her, and get her fourth, uh, her fourth title reign? <laughs> but uh, anyway, so we had doing a chance for both wrestlers to start. Man, Baker went for the lockjaw early, but Sheeta avoided it and then uh, traded two counts. And then Sheeta draped uh, break, uh, Baker over the apron and hit her with a knee lift from the floor, hitting into a PIP break. Uh, but then out of that PIP break, Sheeta uh, applied a guillotine, released it, and then drilled um, Baker with a knee strike. And then Sheeta went for a move from the ropes and then rolled through when uh, Baker moved. Baker caught Sheeta with a kick. Uh, Sheeta came back with an elbow strike. And then uh, Baker dropped her with a super kick. Both wrestlers actually traded pin attempts. And then Baker took Sheeta down with an arm bar. Uh, Sheeta put her down, uh, foot on the ropes. And then Sheeta actually at... Uh, agonized over rather to use the Kindle stick in the corner and appeared to opt against it and then Sheeta blocked uh, a super kick and then Sheeta threw a kick at Baker so this thing was starting to get to a point where it could go either way but I was like there's no way Britt Baker's going to lose in her first match back but Sheeta performed a Falcon Arrow but then Baker stuffed the next Sheeta attempt move and then called her in for a lockjaw and got the win so that was all she wrote for Hikari Sheeta in a little bit over 10 minutes as Britt Baker gets the win in her return match man so, nice work from Britt Baker. Looks like she's ready to go for all in against um, Mercedes Monet. Mercedes Monet is a really good in ring wrestler. I think she's going to make, if, if you got any concerns about this match, I, th I definitely think she's going to make uh, Britt Baker look pretty good in this one. So, um, I definitely think that this is going to be a pretty good one for Britt Baker and uh, Mercedes Monet. Now, if all three, because like I said, this woman's division has been on fire since uh early in the month i'm, I'm gonna tell you what out of the three beats statland or nightingale uh baker monet and then uh mariah may and time of sony storm between those three i think mariah may and storm is going to tear the house down i think out of those three but this one could be second uh, it just depends on what, because Statlander always makes her opponents look good too, but Will Nightingale is really good. So this is going to be really tough. Y'all let me know in the comments section which one y'all think is going to be better. But but we're going to go over what happened after the match in the next video with Camille, the former NWA Women's Champion. We'll talk about her in the next video, man. But go on ahead and give this video a like, share, subscribe. Y'all thank y'all for watching this one after news tonight.